Both Stevenage and MK Dons exited at round one last season, so having already progressed a stage further, it's a place in the area quarter-finals up for grabs. Williams with the free kick off the crossbar. Chris Day, the goalkeeper, may have got a fingertip on that. Looking to take on two defenders and did well. Powell to get the shot in. Day saves with his legs this time. He did well, Doughty. Plays the ball through to Lucas Aikens, but the flag's up for offside. Here's McLeod. Well, he's done well, McLeod, there's a tussle, and the referee decides to award the penalty. It will be Steve Williams, and sends the goalkeeper the wrong way to put the Dons in front. Making space for the shot, Doughty curled in, and deflected past Ian McLaughlin by Francois Zoko. And Stevenage are back on level terms. Stevenage had a buy in round one, so they're... Make the most of getting through to this stage and good ball in by Philip Moraes. I think the referee has given a second penalty of the game and a chance for Philip Moraes to put Stevenage in front for the first time and sends Ian McLaughlin in the Dons goal the wrong way. Now Banton well, bounced awkwardly in front of the goalkeeper who just chests it wide. Chris Day nicely worked free kick. Freeman. Bamford, good save. Stephen, he should be able to get this one clear. And having come from behind, they've seen off the challenge of MK Dons to put their place in the area quarterfinals.